Oof. What's up guys? It's a new day and that means more opportunities to make gains. So today we're talking about chest. So I'm going to show you a really effective chest workout that you can do that I have been doing for a while now to give you that big square chest. So of course the first and most important exercise is the bench press. I know it sounds boring but bench press is the best exercise you can do. However, it's not only doing the bench press, it's about doing the bench press with the right technique. So you can really target your chest when you press. So it's about getting stronger, but getting stronger with the right technique. So I'm going to show you exactly how you're going to perform the bench press or how I usually perform it to feel a better contraction squeeze in my chest. So most of the time people have problem that they only feel in the front delts and the triceps is taking over because they're just pushing the weight up and down. So what we wanna do is they wanna lay down, take, I usually have a thumbless grip, and I arch my back, and I put the weight up, and I put my shoulder blades, before I start pressing, I put my shoulder blades together. And that's really important, so you can open up your chest. And you're coming down slowly, and you expand your chest to 90 degrees here, and you press and you squeeze your chest at the same time. So it's not about just pushing the weight like this. It's about coming down and squeezing your chest. But what I do is that when I'm coming down, I have the chest and the weight is pulling. So when I'm coming down, the weight comes more of the outer of my hand. So I'm coming down like this and open up my chest and I press. So the weight goes from this at the top to my hand to coming down and I put the weight more at the outer of my hand. So out of my hand, into my hand. So it's almost like a fly movement, but it's a press at the same time. So shoulder blades back, open up your chest, press and squeeze. Okay, so let's go. So as I told you before, to develop a big square chest, you have to hit all the parts of the chest. So this exercise I'm going to show you is called a squeeze press. And that is because you hold the weight like this, you squeeze the weight together, and you press upwards at the same time like this. So here's an awesome exercise to target the upper and inner chest. So think about squeezing your upper and inner chest all the time when you do this exercise. So I think that a lot of exercises, it's hard to feel the upper and inner chest. When you do it, for example, incline dumbbell press, you feel upper chest, but it's almost here, you know. So this is a great exercise you can do to target the upper and the inner chest. So yeah, I'm gonna show you how it's done. I know how fun it can be to bench press, but however, it's not enough to develop that big, full looking chest because if you want a chest, a plate looking chest, you know, that square, you have to develop the upper chest as well. So that is why we have to press from an incline movement as well. So usually 
a decline press targets more of the lower chest and the incline press targets more of the upper chest. So we want to our upper chest to pop so we can have that square plate looking chest. So that is why our next exercise is the incline dumbbell press. And it's the same thing here. So pick up your dumbbells and have a slight incline and your shoulder and your shoulder blades together. So come with the weight up and put your shoulder blades together like this. So come down with the weight almost to your clavia and you press up and focus on the upper chest this time. So come down and squeeze the upper chest. So three seconds down and explode the weights up. Okay, so let's go guys. Okay, so we move on to the third exercise and this time it's a fly movement because we've been doing presses, regular presses, we've been doing incline presses and this time it's time to work on the inner chest. So there's no better way to work on the inner chest than doing fly movement. However, I like to perform flies with plates instead of dumbbells. That is because if you're holding in dumbbells, your forearm will get engaged in the movement and we have plates you can focus more on only squeezing your chest. So I like to have my legs on the bench, put the plates up, and the same thing here guys, your shoulder blades together, coming down, open up your chest, coming up, and squeeze. So slow negative, three seconds down, open up your chest, and coming up, and squeeze. And this is my new favorite chest exercise, but it's because it's so fun to see how much it can do when you change from dumbbells to plates. So try this exercise out. I really love it and recommend it, guys. So yeah, let's go. Okay, so that's it guys. This was my chest workout that I usually do twice a week and you can do as well. However, the most important thing is not that you only do this workout, it's that you perform it with the right technique because there's no more important thing that you target the right muscle fibers to force your muscles to grow. Because if you just go through the motion without any squeeze or mind-muscle connection, your chest will never grow. So that is so important that you keep that in mind, guys. It's just four exercises, but it's four really great effective exercises to target your whole chest, your upper, your lower, and your inner chest. So yeah, try it out, tag a friend below you wanna try this workout with, and let me know what you think down in the comments. So yeah. Till next time, stay shredded, bro.